Hi everyone. Um, I just wanted to share some of my new flowers with you. I've been playing around. Um, these are just the, uh, I don't know, faux grunge flowers. Um, I don't have grunge paper. So I just use regular paper with um, Mod Podge painted on the back. And then just put them together the same way that um, Tim Holt shows. Except I um, didn't cut the bottoms off. I just kind of smushed them down. But these are the new tattered flowers from his dye. I just recently got it. And what I did on these, um, I had had previously from another project some leftover um, old patterns, like, you know, dress patterns that I had hit adhered to um, cardstock with Mod Podge. I don't know if you can see the pattern through the paper. It just gives it a little bit more dimension. But then I sprayed it with my homemade glimmer mist and um, curled over the base one. And then this one, as you're heat setting it, it kind of curls up on its own. So that was curled on its own and then I just layered it and put in a brad in. And here's another one. And they're so pretty but they are quite large. So I don't know what I'm going to use them for. Because I make cards and I don't think that would fit in an envelope. So. But. There's the backing. I just like the way the the um pattern paper underneath gives it, I don't know, nice thickness. And this one I also um brushed with um crackle paint. The rock candy kind. So, anyway, here's another fake grunge flower. So, anyway, thought I'd show you. Um, any comments or anything? I'd be grateful to hear them. Okay, thank you. Have a great day, y'all.